Hi there. In this video, we are going to cover the patch request, HTTP patch request, and how that is different from your put request. So this is also used to update an existing record. However, in case of put, what you do is you send the complete object, means you send the complete JSON document. In case of patch, you can send only the patch of the JSON document, means the thing that is being changed, just send that. Don't send the complete JSON document. Okay. And here's a link where you can read more about JSON patch format. And I'll open that in a while. Okay. So this is a basic structure of a patch request. You send the, uh, you enter in the endpoint URL. Uh, the method is going to be patch. You pass in the authorization detail. You send in the request header. Uh, for example, even though you are sending a patch of the JSON document, it is still a JSON document. So therefore, the content type that you're going to send in your request uh, as a header will carry the value uh, application forward slash JSON. Okay. And then uh, the request payload is going to be your JSON patch document and pa patch parameter will demonstrate what resource you are trying to update. Okay. So it will look something like this. Uh, and you could see that the body is slightly different. So you're going to pass in the body in the form of an array. And this is the patch that we are sending. In this particular case, you could see that we are saying that, hey, in this patch document, uh, the operation that I'm trying to achieve is replaced. And what you have to do is go to this particular path in the JSON document and update the value of the speed to 60. Okay. So now let's see that in Postman. So let me open the postman and move to the workspace we have been working on. So because this is like put only, so I'm going to copy this. Okay, and first of all, let me change this to patch and it is going to be patch an animal. Okay, and in the body, instead of sending this whole thing, what do I have to pass? I have to pass this. Okay, so let's see first of all uh, what animal we are trying to update. Okay, so let's post an animal, uh, rabbit again. The speed is 35, herbivorous, and lifespan 18. So let's click on that. Okay, so the ID is 18. Let's check that into the database as well. So a new record is created in this animal animal stable we go to our slide uh, we go to postman okay so we use this id now id is equal to 18 and we go to our patch request we say hey this resource i'm trying to update and now go to the speed and set its value to 60 what is the current value we see now the current value is 35 okay so let's hit the send button and you see the value is updated to 60 but now also check that in our database and here also the value is 60 okay now let me delete that uh, and the id is 18 so i'm just deleting that and checking that in my database and the record is deleted now let's open that uh, reference link and see what json patch is so JSON patch is a format for describing changes to a JSON document. What is a JSON document in our case? Whatever we, the request payload that we are sending along with our request, right? That's a JSON document. And if you could see that the a JSON patch document is just a JSON file containing an array of patch operations. The patch operations supported by JSON patch are these are the operations that are supported. And in our case, we just picked one out of those and that was the replace operation okay so we said replace the value that is there at this part to 60 it was 35 right in the in the post it was 35 and we changed we replaced that value to 60 using the syntax so in case of patch by now you must have realized that you know you have to pass data in a specific format and you can read more about you know the format and all from this website it's a very uh, great website if you can see <clears throat> so add is one of the operation they explain what add is remove 
again removes a value from a, from an object in this particular case what they are saying is so imagine this is an array and they are saying the remove the value at zeroth index okay so this is what we uh, picked in our case why we said replace the value in this case what they are saying is replace the name with this okay the value of this key all right so it might be whatever let's xyz now they are changing it to chocolate digestive okay and copy move and test so it's it's not that complicated simple just do it a couple of more times and you'll be able to get hold on that right so this is our patch request uh and of course authorization is already there okay uh so this is it i guess for patch uh, thank you so much i'll